If like me you've been having problems getting your splice samples to load onto the Dirty Wave M8, uh, this is the solution. Um, this is a copy of my splice folder on my Mac uh, so that I don't mess up my actual splice folder. Basically it's the same thing. And just imagine you've taken your SD card out of your Dirty Wave M8, put it on your Mac and I'm sure it works the same on the PC, and you want to drag samples from your splice folders onto your M8. And if you just drag the splice file, the entire thing, onto your M8 uh, micro SD card, uh, it will copy all the folders and everything. And that's a problem because uh, on the M8 you've got the limit of 128 characters, not just for the name of the sample, which is this thing over here, this is the actual thing that you play, this WAV file, but all these enclosing folders add to the total. So you look, you've got, um, going back here, you've got uh, sounds, packs. This one here is called uh, 808 Mafia Presents, you know, massive great long title. And then you've got another folder there, and another one here, another one here. And then you actually get to the, you can't go through every single folder and, and count up and see if there are 128 characters used, but I'd be betting in this particular example uh, it's way past 128, that includes gaps and things, uh, underscores. So what is the answer? Well the answer is, and I got this from Timothy himself, he's the guy who uh, is the main man at uh, Dirty Way. He said the thing to do is look through your folders and just get rid of the duplications in the name. So for instance here, uh, we know this is 808 Mafia, well one thing you could do straight away, you don't need all this the family sample pack so go in here and you could backspace an awful lot of this and buy yourself loads of character spaces so I would take this down to 808 Mafia press return and then you've got a much shorter name and then go to the next folder well um, okay you don't really need south side do you I mean so again I would go to sample pack and I'd backspace that and press return and then let's go to the next folder. I'm sure you're getting the idea. Um, so this is tonal, you know, go through and backspace all the stuff you don't need out to give yourself more character spaces, bringing it way below the 128. And then when you put your card back in your MA, all these samples will be read without any problem. So if you're having trouble it's because you've got too many character names not just in the name of the actual sample itself but with all these folders that enclose that sample and yes it is a bit of a rigmarole maybe maybe Tim will sort that out in the future maybe there'll be a way to get more than 128 um, but if you're like me a, a splice subscriber it's great to get all those lovely splice samples on your M8 for use in your songs. Anyway I hope that helps and thank you for watching.